All right, in today's tutorial, we're, we're talking about uh, <clears throat> the chart of accounts that products uh, have on their product card. So typically, when we create a new product, uh, if and I'm just going to go into one for example here, we're going to click on this chair floor protection. But typically, uh, when you open it up, it opens to this general information section, and you can see all of the information about this this product and you can see attributes and variants sales yada yada all the fun stuff well if we go to i'm just going to refresh it so i can go ahead and edit uh if we go to our accounting page there's no default or there's no account set here so what happens is when we sell this it gets booked to product sales now there might be a time when you want to change where where something you sell gets booked to. This could be if you have, you know, if you want to put a gift card under more of a liability account rather than a product sales account, you can do that for whatever reason. And this is how you do it. All, we, all we're going to do is come in here and we're going to change the account. And you can just type in, if you know your, your account code, you can put it in there, your account number. And... Uh, and you can put it there. So now every time I, I sell this chair, if I were to save it, it, instead of booking it to product sales, it would book it to expenses, which obviously we don't want for this, but uh, you can do that. So you can remap where your products, uh, where those sales get booked to. So just a quick tutorial on, on how to do that. At the end, you would save it and you'd be good to go. So uh, that's the, just a quick tutorial on how to do that, and we will see you in another tutorial. Thanks.